Welcome back to Insight. We're here at the Nick. Entrepreneurs made here, learning more about uh, some of the businesses that uh, have uh, kind of grown out here. And uh, we want to talk to Chris about uh, what it is that you do uh, and how the Nick has helped. So explain kind of the faces of your business. Well, I came here in 2013, and the backdrop is uh, this. I came out of a, a background of uh, politics and journalism and had this kind of a epiphany experience in 2011 that what I was doing for politicians, I could do for other kinds of people too. Stood on that, thought about it for a couple of years. 2013, came here, opened up a business, not exactly knowing what I wanted to do, but mm -hmm. having, having a sense that, having a sense of where I wanted to go with this. So I came here and started a, um, a business called ReSermon. Mm -hmm. And this was going to be a business that helps basically do what I was doing for politicians, apply it to pastors who lecture and preach every Sunday, and then they need to repurpose that content for greater or larger purposes, a lot like what I was doing for politicians, mm -hmm. writing editorials, press releases, and that kind of thing. And uh, then we realized that was insufficient to reach a different, uh, more markets like businessmen and artists and scientists and professors. They really needed a different kind of platform, so we launched a different kind of business uh, called Pump Jack. Mm -hmm. And the Nick has been a, a wonderful support in getting those businesses, actually it's one business with two different brand expressions, right. but basically getting those launched. Uh, Carl Pan and uh, Mike Fritch have been wonderful supports. When, when you came here originally, what was the name of your company? Uh, really good, succinct name like Christopher Mann Communications <laughs> Incorporated. Right. You know, say that three times real fast. Right. Uh, and so they kind of helped you focus like, you know what, we want to we want a name that is means what it is or something more like that. And well, so that's a challenge that a lot of businesses come here with. They say, I have an idea. It's unrefined. I need to talk to someone. I need to, them, them to listen to me. I need to actually say it out loud. And that's actually the refinement process that was mm -hmm. so helpful for me. It's helpful for a lot of different um, uh, businesses at launch here and I had to actually hone my thinking and understand the next steps sequentially what do I need to do next and that's where we, the, the idea for resermon and pump check yeah started. because we will uh, say that a lot to people that we've met out here that it's one thing to have the idea it's another thing to run the business that does the idea mm -hmm. you know two different skill sets they really are and I am very much a, a big picture kind of kind of thinker and it's, it's been a challenge for me to actually put one foot in front of the uh, in front of the other and actually sequentially uh, understand how to get to the goal mm -hmm. and I've had a lot of good support people come around me and say and help me develop this business get the contractors in order um, pay the bills on time and in sequence and so uh, it's been very helpful here that's pretty exciting and uh, again I think it's interesting that you've been able to uh, take these kind of these these thoughts that pastors have or professors have or, or business people have and then get them outside of their their you know original audience uh, and do that as a business because I would never that would never occur to me that 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 there's a, a business there I guess I think actually that's what I'm finding out uh, a lot here in Midwest in in the East Coast and in the West Coast in New York and LA uh, public relation firms like this are a dime a, do well, mm -hmm. a dime a dozen they're pretty expensive but right. they're all over the place right I mean, but they're not that popular in the in the Midwest, and so what I looked for and I found is a is a pretty wide open market here, in uh, the Midwest, especially Indiana. That's so great. It's been it's been a great experience to actually introduce this. And sometimes you do get the blank look, and they're asking, "What? You know, please explain this for the fourth time." But um, they eventually catch on, and it's it's a it's a it's a helpful thing. That's pretty cool. Uh, if you want more information about uh, getting your ideas, I guess, repurposed, uh, you can contact uh, these guys uh, at their website, or you can uh, contact the Nick if you've got an idea that you want to turn into a business. We'll be right back on Instagram.